Michael Valentino from Crusader Caravans in Campbellville, Victoria. Today we have the pleasure of introducing you to the brand new addition to the CRV range. This guy is the Gladiator Force, long awaited. This guy here offers a boundless extras to that of the Gladiator and a nice little increase of bed space and seating opportunity with a whole new colour scheme introductory to the CRV model. Built on the foundation that you'd know the CRVs from as far as its layout, its setting, its features, its benefits, this guy's ready to roll. Take your orders now, get him while you can, let me show you what we got. So we've got a six inch A-frame all the way back to the wheels, stock standard as you can appreciate, 450 MPA graded steel, Australian steel, three millimeters thick, with a um, cutaway uh, semi-recess DO35 coupling standard, with a rotative jockey wheel, with a little praying mantis hiding on the top here. We've got a full stone guard across the flaps with mud flap protection, as well as stone guard protectors and all tap wear, your breakaway, no battery required. We're running on this model a seven pin flat, as well as a grey Anders plug for battery charging. We have our underhook Matador hooks from Intel Engineering, and it's seated on a 2.7 ton fully independent suspension. That guy's gonna give you full autonomous movement, fully off-road, it's 2.7 ton with 16 inch wheels and tires. It's absolutely ready for any adventure you throw at it. This guy here comes equipped with a massive spotlight at the front, LED clearance and reflector side clearance lights all the way through. We have a large toolbox on the front of the Gladiator Force, with a brand new turquoise ticker set, a sticker set to match. We have a slide out barbecue slide with a heap of opportunity for storage in the back end. This guy here just pulls, locks into place and then closes nice and flush. Opportunity for upgrades as far as jerry cans and whatnot. On the side, we have a tunnel boot storage similar to that of the CRV Hurricane, almost a meter wide, equipped with a jack for easy lift. This guy's tearing at about 1650. This one's coming in at 1690. Has a little bit of whiz bang stuff in it. You've got your uh, wheel brace, your jack winder, as well as our PM300 charging unit there in the back with 50 amp breaker. Again, equipped with, you can see all the way through, we've got 16 mil ply um, as far as ABS coated board for all of your structural need. The tunnel boot locks up like so, nice and flush. Underneath, we have our gas bayonet for cooking as well as Manutech drop down legs. We have our A-frame again, just highlighting, running all the way back to the wheels. You don't see that on any of your Chinese imports. This guy here is guaranteed uh, um, ADR build and compliance as far as structural steel and chassis manufacturing. We have outside TV points, so outside TV, 12 volt cigarette. We have an aerial point and a double power point there located in the TV hutch, so all your power needs are taken care of. This guy comes with, you'll notice how big it is. It's about a 3.2 meter awning. It is absolutely massive. We've equipped this one with the extra upgrade because we have the extra length located in this area here as well as our front tunnel boot compared to that of the Gladiator. Fuel electrical upgrades as well, which we'll go into. We have outside light. We have security mesh fly screen door ready for any adventure with roller bind. Couples back like so. It comes standard with a picnic table on the outside for all of your entertainment needs. Chicken play wheel guard. We've got ABS internal wheel covering there and mud flap Crusader patent, of course. Outside speakers, nice and low, keep the party going. There's outside Bluetooth capabilities, of course, as well. The manufacturing style of the Gladiator Force, which we'll highlight inside, is a 32 millimeter fully insulated composite panel with fire retardant foam, non-ingressible, no water, no dust, no nothing. Absolutely state of the art. Uh, Crusader Caravans manufacturer of the year, bringing the latest and greatest to the caravan range. Our awning goes all the way through, clips on. Of course, you have the opportunity as well with the Gladiator Force to lower the arms, so that'll drop down. We can bring it out and then you can drop one arm down, leave it up, so you have free range walk all the way through. It's a massive area of entertainment space. Electric steps, zzz, and zzz, out. Very good at mimicking sounds. We have an inside grab handle, of course, with a full bank of drawers, but we'll save him for later. Awning winder, we have all of our side clearance lights with the Audi style indicator light as it goes all the way through because just a little bit of flare makes all the difference. A wireless fury on camera with another spotlight on the front there. That wireless fury on camera, no wires required. We just plug it into a cigarette socket upon handover, plug it in, bang, we're looking straight down the neck of the caravan. It rotates down and up, allows for that automotive clearance of where you actually want to end up. Number plate, this guy's registered, ready to roll. We have our spare tire here on the back, 16 inch, 245 all-terrain wheels and tires from Primal Wheels and Tires. Making our way through guys, we have our Toilets canister, of course, goes on like so. Pop him out, give him a spin, and we've got our water filler there on the top. So that's our toilet cassette area, all sealed units, of course. The sticker on this guy here is really, really impressive. So it goes, it spans all the way through. It's a nice collaboration between that of the Gladiator and the Hurricane. Gives that awesome little clearance, uh, awesome little look about it, 
and brings a little bit of flair to the whole range as well. We've got um, inside 186 litre compressor fridge, so fridge vents tops and bottom. Outside window for our ensuite as well as our radio aerial. All the vents are associated with all of our microwaves and range hoods, of course. Underneath, we've got our grey water tank, our flush tank, our undercoat pipe protection. We have a fridge breather vent as well as our um, mains pressure water filler, so you can suck water in easily just with the suck of the hose plugging into this unit here with our mud flap there, keeping everything nice and protected. Individual tank itemization and tank use from our water pump. Mains inlet plug, we have our circuit breaker here, of course. Side LED clearance, two water filler caps, I believe they're rated at the 95 litre mark. Could be wrong, but I'll be double checked. We have our Truma gas heater outlet for our carbon dioxide, so it does in fact come as standard equipped with a Truma Iverio gas heater. 28 litre stainless steel Australian hot water unit by the team at Swift. Our double glazed Dometic windows, as well as three click phase locking. And then back in, nice and easy. We have our checker plate storage tunnel boot all the way through and our PM300 system. So ready for pretty much any adventure you throw it in. We've also got our gas bottle, so quick disconnect, we can pull those guys out there. Um, that gives you and houses your two nine kilo gas bottles. So pretty much as far as free camp goes, you're ready to roll on any front. The checker plate uh, toolbox on the top, option him up, you can go for that at uh, bikes and whatnot, fire boxes, a few different options Crusader offer. That is the full outside of our Gladiator Force. It's a tiny little van, but it summarizes itself so nicely in the fact that it's quaint, it is ready for any adventure, it's the full off-road unit, you can throw anything at it. What's the inside look like? Great question, follow me in. So inside the caravan, we have a full black trim fit out. I might have to pop this guy off, he's nice and cool. It is absolutely freezing. So we've got the traditional single beds that form to a queen. The Duna covers do not come with it, although I don't know that you want them, they're not great looking. We have timber finished matte cupboards with 40 newton meter ga uh, reinforced gas struts and full side piano hinging all the way through. This is built the same way as our 100,000 plus caravan, dollar value van, sorry. Um, the build quality is not changed in any way, shape or form. You've got those fully insulated composite walls. If you pop this guy off here, you'll see what I'm talking about. We're talking about the foam retardant area. So that guy is there, he's completely fire, waterproof, dustproof, it's flat to the composite. The window easily just snaps back on, but you can see from the build quality of it, there's absolutely no timber at all in this caravan construction. And it's fully built in Australia, 100% Australian made. We bring goods in, obviously, from our suppliers like NCE. Origins are known, of course, they get and source their own little material from other places, but they're trusted known partners within the caravan industry that we support and they support us. Let me tell you about the inside. So we have two single beds, the form door queen. There's two options in this option here. One is you can pop a table just at the front. Currently, there's no bracket here, but this is our display van. The normal ones, you can pop a little bracket and you can be able to, um, you can have another seating area here. So I can be sitting, having a nice cup of tea, loving it, enjoying it. Alternatively, I can be laying back on five foot nothing. This is nice and easy, lay back, and you've got a bedside table area to be able to pop another a nice little cuppa. You can have three cuppas going at the same time, completely up to you. You do whatever you like, it's your caravan, I'm not gonna argue with you. Then we have another configuration where there's a position here where the table goes in, locks into the front, and there is another table area here for day-to-day -day use. You can pop the table here and we're having a coffee opposite one another. There's a few different options. Two Sirocco fans here are standard. Just on that, we're gonna show you those options as we go through this video in another highlighted window. We have our Sirocco fans, three speeds. We have our wine guard aerial for easy TV reception use. We have our full block out hatch, as well as fly screen hatch with a nice pull down and push. Very easy to lock in with LED strip lighting all the way through. It comes with a DRS full Dometic dust reduction system and a normal model would be a filter up here that completely dust suppresses the whole caravan. It keeps all the air nice and tight inside the unit whilst traveling. We've got those full block out, midgy proof screens. We have three overhead cupboards with advanced storage all the way through. We have pillow top. So you'll notice it just here. We have the pillow topped inner spring mattress um, that zip together. They have the little zip so they can go together to be able to create that queen, or alternatively you can rotate them the whole 180. Um, to that of the Gladiator, you'll notice there's no drawer under this unit. The reason for that is we have batteries that lie under this unit here and a whole tunnel boot arrangement underneath here. Happy to give you a look because it's better to ask because you might not be able to get down. So we've got a lift up lid and a full storage area underneath there, ready for an extra battery, ready to go. Um, that there is a 200, so you heard that right. 
It is a 200 amp lithium battery um, from the team at Lithium Lab. The lithium battery at 200 amp is gonna give you a heap of capability. So huge discharge advantage of that. You're gonna be able to get a heap of storage and a heap of room. Underneath here is our gas heater. So our gas heater is gonna flood the van with heat on a cooler day. Um, it means free camping as far as heating, cooling. You don't have to roll on the air conditioner for that heating. You're gonna be able to get the heating from that gas Truma Iverio European unit. We have 12 volt USB as well as double power point. We have a microwave with no plate. So that guy just pops in there, nothing to take out when you travel. Popping back, we have our Bel Air 2400 unit. This guy's specifically made for this caravan and, and that is to be able to keep the roof nice and compact to allow those two 190 watt solar panels up there, monocrystalline panels pumping power into the uh, battery management system from the PM300, which is hiding in this cupboard here. So we have our sphere box, we have our RV Wi-Fi kit. So you heard that right, RV Wi-Fi is distributing through the whole caravan. Electric hot water, gas hot water, air conditioner switch up like so. The PM300 unit LCDs uh, inside the tunnel boot as well as the LCD up here. We have a 28 inch TV, gas heater control, USB, double power point, double power point, aerial lead here. Um, the 28 is most and better served in that of a sleeping position, but it's a nice uh, smart TV equipped in the Gladiator Force. As far as storage, we have full shelved units. We have our slide out drawers. There's a heap of space in here. So again, just to highlight the construction material, you've got your metal sided draw runners, you've got fully composite construction in polycomp base and polycomp flooring, as well as your um, NX slate matte anti-fingerprint cupboards. These have been an absolute breeze to clean after the caravan show, I'll tell you that. Now, this is why we're all here. Why did we go to the Gladiator, to the Gladiator Force? The Gladiator Force offers these two seats. So you've got these two little settees right here, easy. We've been hearing it for ages. Oh, we want a seat. We want a seat. So Crusaders, listen, they've gone to a seat. So this table arrangement allows for that seat. Nice sausage roll in the afternoon, whatever you're after. This guy here comes absolutely ready to roll with anything. Cold outside, pop inside, sausage rolls, whatever you need. This guy here is going to allow you to be able to eat inside, eat outside, live inside, live outside. We understand that this one here is a needed addition to the market and it is an absolute ripper. Cannot wait to get a few more on the road. Our little camera lady here is gonna show you our reading light with USB installed underneath it. So you've got all of your charging needs inside that of the Gladiator Force. Now, we've gotta talk about the stuff that's important, food. We've gotta take heaps of food, obviously. So we have 186 liters worth of a fridge. The 186 liter fridge is like so. Heaps of storage room, that's a full compressor unit, so 186 litre compressor, radio up the top, outside speakers, inside speakers, light for the inside of the uh, shower toilet, and we have our NCS speakers inside. Don't need a lot of volume because obviously the sound is so compact in this unit, you're going to be able to actually keep them quite low, but they're very, very good quality units. We have our combination shower and toilet with caravan face washers, I may add. We have our cupboard up the top with toilet chemicals, nice and easy our shower curtain, our toilets from Thetford compact unit. We have a black shower uh, fitting, our rows, our little basin here in the corner, and then the polycom unit. So this guy's a completely watertight unit. Um, you've got your window on the side for a bit of outside looking, whatever you'd like. Keep the, uh, keep the uh, humidity nice and low in here. We just go click, 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 pops out nice and easy. Very, very easy to use, full block out, whatever you're after. So a really cool addition. The black frame, something really special to that of the Crusader range. And then finally, the things that people love, food, food, food. We've got outside uh, three-way mixer tap for filter system. So just like so. We have our double power point in the kitchen um, with a return to be able to keep it all nice and compact. In these cupboards, we have a camera switch to keep the camera activated whilst traveling. We have our range hood. Again, full piano hinging, doesn't matter what cupboard it is. Full range hood from Finch with our LED little light. I think we've got to pop them on and then bang, there we go. We've got a four burner cooktop, our grill, Again, very important, Australian made unit. You're not getting into this going, what cooktop is it? Oh, it's a whatever it may be. This guy here is an Australian made unit. Everything in this is a well-known brand. There isn't anything we're bringing in you haven't heard of, nothing that's not available. Parts ready to get. Bullnose bench tops, flowers. We have our full drawer system, again. For a little van, they've just kept everything so compact. We have our full drawer as well. 
This guy here is just loaded with features from that of the standard Gladiator. The main difference if you're in the market and you want somewhere to have a seat, the Gladiator Force is the one. If you need something that's gonna give you the 186 and the microwave without spending the money that you're gonna be looking at the Hurricane, the Gladiator's the one. If you wanna be able to go to something that's a little bit different and it's not Chinese made or imported or something that you want to be able to have that backup and absolute national guarantee. You cannot go past Crusader Caravans. Manufacturer of the Year, three years running. Dealership of the Year, Crusader Caravans, Melbourne, Campbellfield. You give us a call. If you need anything at all, give us a call on 93592938. Head to the website as more information comes out, www.crusadercaravansmelbourne.com.au. Alternatively, guys, we'll see you at the next show. We'll see you on the road. Like and subscribe for more. We'll see you next time.